Hello there, Runneneers. It's Manny again. And if I do seem excited, it's because I'm really excited. I just got back from D23. Uh, if you guys don't know, this is where they announce every big announcement when it comes to movies, TV shows, rides, uh, just restaurants, uh, resorts on down the line. And I, I got, I was there for all three days. I got so excited. I told you guys I was going to share anything that they said was Run Disney related. Uh, but I actually predicted that they weren't going to say anything about Run Disney directly. But I thought indirectly there is going to be some things that are going to affect it. And guys, if you have not heard, the breaking news was amazing. So I'll set it up because I was actually in the queuing area. Just waiting to see if I can get up there and check out the parks panel. I was in a standby line, so I didn't even know if I was going to make it up. So we were watching on our phones as we were moving and they finally said, you guys are going to go in. So it had already been going on for about 10 or so minutes. And that's when I pressed stop recording and I was walking up. As I was entering and I was enter entering stage left, I remember walking down my aisle and I could see the Jumbotron, Josh tomorrow is out in the background and all of a sudden he announces, talk about running, I just wanted to add that the Run, uh, the run Disney events are coming back to California in 2024. So boy was I wrong and I am so glad that I was wrong that they weren't going to announce anything. Now guys, if you haven't figured it out, I kind of knew that they were going to be back by 2025. I have some sources who were letting me know, but I was sworn to secrecy. I couldn't say anything. If you guys noticed, and some of you had noticed because you were commenting down below saying, are they really coming back? And I was trying to hint it to you guys that yes, they're coming back because some people were like, oh, they're never coming back. And I would say, keep the faith. That's a hint. So for future reference, if I ever say keep the faith or whatever, that means I've heard that there's a possibility that they are coming back and they are back. So what does that mean? That means we're going to have a bunch of runs. Now I'm going to do a whole video just on Run Disney in California. That one's going to be coming up in the next week or two. I um, wanted to give you ideas because questions that still have to be answered. Are they going to be all four of the runs that used to be there? What happens to Club Run Disney? And I think this is going to be one of the best things that can happen to you guys who love the Run Disney events in, in, in Florida, the people who haven't been able to get in because there's some mass, uh, a, mass amount, a massive amount of people trying to get in. Now think about it this way. And this is why I say it's good news for the people that are trying to run Florida is the United States is split in half. Basically, you got your East Coast and your West Coast um, when it comes to the Disney World and Disneyland. Now look at it this way now. So what's going to happen is a lot of these people closer to the West Coast that actually started coming toward Disney World and caused a lot of the logjam, the unusual logjam that hadn't happened in years. There was things that would sell out a little bit faster, but not as quickly as they have been. So now those people are probably going to go back to running in the West Coast. And there's going to be a, a probably at the beginning a good group of the people that are running at Disney World right now that are going to say, you know what? Now that they're back, I'm going to go try that one over there. So guys, there is a chance that when they uh, do announce, which I believe it's going to be early next year when they're going to announce when they're going to have the runs at Disney at Disneyland and which ones they're going to have, that means there, there's going to be a possibility that you can sign up a little bit faster for the Disney World marathons. And so that potentially is good news because of the splitting. But again, I'll go into video because again, there's uh, coast to coast. Forgot about that. But again, I wanted to make this video about stuff that uh, that D23 said that's going to affect us. And we already got one out of the way, which is the Disneyland California runs are back. So the next announcement that really is going to affect us is Epcot. Epcot is not going to be finished. So those walls at the front where Innovations East and West and some, you know, now they have the Creations uh, Cafe and the Creation Shop. That's still going to be there. But those walls are not going to be coming down probably until mid to late next year. So guess what? For the 2022-2023 season, uh, going all the way to springtime surprise, we're probably going to have those walls that we're going to have to run around. So it isn't like it used to be. It used to be a little bit more fun when you could run and you had open spaces and it was a lot better. And that is coming back probably again for the following season after this season. But that's another announcement that they made that will directly impact our running paths. So number three is one that I'm going to kind of group together because it's the concept art 
for possible expansions to Magic Kingdom and Animal Kingdom. Now the one that can affect this is the one in Animal Kingdom because Primeval World is already closed. So that part of it, they might start the expansion there. Now they're gonna have to add further on. If you haven't heard, uh, Zootopia and Moana are rumored to go there. The concept art is out, so it's not, it's a little bit more than the rumor stage, but it's not 100% sure, but it, it is possibly going back there. So if they start building back there, that's where we run out. And so if they're building back there, then we're gonna have to either really, really, they're gonna have to either do the construction a little bit further out or we're gonna have to be exiting somewhere else or it's gonna be a very narrow exit. Those are the possibilities that can happen at Animal Kingdom. Now in Magic Kingdom, if you guys haven't heard, these are really exciting when it comes to the rides. Behind uh, Big Thunder Mountain, there's supposed to be a possible Coco, uh, possible uh, Encanto, and behind that, this is the one where it kind of gets fuzzy because they say it's a villain's land, but it's not 100% sure if it's another park. I don't think it's going to be another park. But even then, when you really map out where we run, we just basically run and breeze right by uh, Big, Mon uh, Big Thunder Mountain. So we don't even hit that area. So while they're building back there, that really won't affect us. Now, where it can affect us in the future is they built uh, far enough and there's exits back there. We get to run through those lands, which would be really, really amazing. So that would be cool to run out of there. So I'll go over number four, which is really nothing. I always say number four because I'm going to touch Hollywood Studios. Nothing is really being built there. I, I think they have the Toy Story uh, Cafe, the sit-down restaurant. That's not going to affect us. But it has affected us in the fact that we actually, in the last springtime surprise, were able to run through Hollywood Studios. So that's going to be an added bonus that we're going to have that to run into. Uh, there's really nothing when it comes to the resorts because that usually uh, can dictate with the closures of the, the, the streets and stuff. But really there's nothing, there was no major announcements there. So the other announcements is ha that can affect us is the IPs, the intellectual properties, and that can affect the theming of runs. So one that is probably going to be affected if they bring back the Star Wars theming, which I, I believe they will, they are now adding a little bit more Mandalorian to it and Baby Yoda, Grogu, whatever you want to call him. Uh, so I believe, because there's going to be the meet and greets that are coming, I believe that uh, that might be a possibility when they do a springtime surprise with Star Wars, that that's a possibility that they might have a Mandalorian, Boba Fett, uh, Grogu themed medals and that, that would be really, really cool. Now when it comes to movies, I thought this was an interesting one because Next, next uh, summer, summer of 2023 is going to be Indiana Jones Part 5. And of those of you who didn't see, the one and only Harrison Ford made an appearance at D23, which was so amazing. It was hard not to get emotional listening to him, but think about it. Indiana Jones is such a iconic character and he's brought a lot to a lot of our lives. We almost got teary-eyed there, but think about it. So next summer is the summer virtual series what a great way to kind of uh make that an ip the indiana jones and you can have the medals for for the the summer virtual runs i think that would be a great idea and i think that's a great idea for an ip there and the last one i want to throw out is going to be a really really big wild card because i went to the panel i enjoyed it i had a blast i was laughing my my butt off it was so funny it was the simpsons so what are the chances are that the Simpsons might be an IP that they might use? The chances are none. They're not going to use it. But I, 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 I'd like to think that they are at least think about it because I love the Simpsons. So that'd be fun. But they're still at Universal. We don't know what's going to happen. So besides that, that's it for this video. Uh, this is all that I really, really saw. Now there may be some other stuff that I that didn't cover, I missed, that can be covered. But Let's turn it over to you guys. What are you so? Are you excited about the California runs? Will you be doing the California runs when they come? Will you be interested in doing a coast to coast? And I have an idea, uh, some ideas of what they could do with that, and that's coming in my next video. Um, guys, are you excited? The fact that there might, uh, or there may be a possibility that there might be some more slots open because uh, the people that are running, that are coming from the west, are no longer going to run for the east, and the people that are in the east might uh, divert some of their funds and go over to the west. So guys, are you excited about that? But comment down below. Guys, keep commenting, keep subscribing, hit subscribe the button. And uh, I guess that's it for now. Guys, I, I, I want you guys to create a magical day and see you sooner than later.